So originally this I was going to split into two videos, but the way I split the clothes when I was organising them into two videos, the second half was full of things that I hated, so I'm just going to make it all into one video right now. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this. Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so today, I'm just so pumped about this. <laughs> After last week's catastrophic nightmare um, of a shitty, shitty haul from uh, Buku Curb, this fair rack is my Shein Plus, Shein Curb haul. Um, there's, I think, 18 pieces, maybe. I don't know, 17, 18, something like that, pieces on here. And the reason they're hanging up is because after last week's little um, debacle, I, I didn't want to go through that again, where I spend four hours filming something and it makes me feel like shit for the whole thing. So I actually unpacked a couple of things and tried them on on Saturday. Spoiler, some of this may be too big, which is a surprise. <laughs> anyway, I bought this stuff from Shein, hmm, I want to say three weeks ago, and it arrived Friday. <laughs> um, I s there's about 350, 600, 400, 600. There's about 350 maybe $400 worth of items here, but I'll give you the discount code that I used. Um, they gave me 30% off. It's now only giving 15%, but 15 is 15, right? Anyway. Okay. I've also got the order open on my phone so that we know what we're looking at and what I ordered it in. This one is this white shirt. And of course this, you know, after the pink shirt issue I had on Friday, I pulled out the fitted white shirt to try on because I was spooked as fuck after that pink shirt. Um, this has got this really nice uh, corset-y kind of gathered, I wouldn't call it a corset, gathered kind of um, waist. And it's also got large sleeves. It doesn't say that it's balloon sleeved, I don't think. No, it just says plus solid, solid pleated waist button front blouse. I got it in a 3X, um, which I sit between a 2X and a 3X on their website. So, because it was a fitted shirt, I definitely got a 3X in this one. With discount, it was $21.22. It kind of looks sli slightly off white, but it's definitely a nice fabric. Uh, it doesn't feel like it will make your hair static, which. When I'm doing stuff with polyester, I always like it to not make my hair stick out like a puff. 90% polyester, 10% spandex. Doesn't feel like there's any stretch in it whatsoever, so I don't know what where the spandex went. But it's in there somewhere. It's... She needs an iron and... I might iron it before I try it on because I actually really like this. When I did put it on on the weekend to show my husband, he said it was see-through and lots of white shirts supposed to be see-through. Okay, this shirt is so cute. The only problem is, look, I will have to... It's just the way it's, like, it's big enough, but it's just the way it sits makes it gape a tiny bit on that button. I love it so much. I don't even care. <laughs> I don't care that it does that. It's so cute. <laughs> it hella needs an iron though, and I'm not about to be doing that shit today. Nope. Here's my janky hanger. Uh, this is the only hanger that this would stay on because it's very slidey and very low V, so it was gonna fall off. Um, this is. I think it's midi length. <laughs> Looks like a ballroom curtain. Um, midi length bodycon dress. 
and I got this in a 2x and it's actually a little blue on top so you, I'll show you one of those sides I'll show you it's actually a little bit big on top it's very um, very fitted obviously because it's bodycon uh, but because it's got this ruching stuff I'm hoping that you can hide a lot of your sins in your folds will I manage it I don't know this one obviously is 100% trying to escape the hangar. <laughs> the Rouge to Bodycon dress, and it was $20.37 after discount. Originally $23.95 for life. And I got that in a 2XL, because Bodycon line is supposed to be. It's supposed to be fitted. Big on top, yeah. It's like really baggy on top. Um, is this the kind of Bodycon I can get away with? Maybe. still think we're gonna need to get some of those shapey shapey smoothie shorts <laughs> yeah so someone took leave of their senses of two jumpsuits in this one <laughs> and you know how I feel about jumpsuits because I have a long torso uh, none of them ever fit right <laughs> this is one of those it's got like a the shelfy do hickey for your boobs. So it's an off shoulder, full length, full length, uh, black jumpsuit. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I, I don't, I, I just want to look nice in a jumpsuit, okay? And I'm still yet to find one. I got this in a 3XL because I'm just trying to give the best chance for me to actually be able to put it up without looking like I've come to fix the boiler. <laughs> this is made of that stretchy jersey sort of fabric, you know, like a t-shirt fabric. Maybe slightly thicker, but I get bummed if I paid more than 20 bucks for it. It's not so much that it's made of t-shirt material, it feels like the kind of t-shirt material, yeah. I'll show you the bottom here. Can you see the bits? There are bits on it. Yeah, it feels like the kind of fabric that's going to pick up every bit of crap, dust, hair, everything, and be like, this is mine now. <laughs> that one was $20.37, so that's not bad. And yeah, I got it at 3X. And that is the Shine Sexy plus off shoulder flare leg jumpsuit. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to make it look sexy, but we'll find out here or here, which I'd put it. <laughs> okay, well this is the most flattering jumpsuit I've ever worn. Um, still not great, because you can see all of this area, like straight from the fabric. It's like, hey, you're wearing underwear. <laughs> Good, we can see it. Um, and like all the lumps and bumps, but that's, not something that can't be solved by one of them smoothie, shapey, panty things, you know? You know the things, I mean. It's comfortable. It's comfortable and it's very flattering. Um, yeah, this is the first time I've ever had a jumpsuit that doesn't make me look like I've come to fix your boiler. Uh, what I feel like it needs is one of those really 90s silver chain belts. You know the one. You know the one. You, you know the one you know needs one of those <laughs> yeah it does doesn't it <sighs> okay this is the next one and it's a oh, that way around it's got buttons on the front it's a little strapless <laughs> guy the boot the ruching what's it called shearing shearing sheared front very stretchy and I think it might actually fit over my boobs, which would be nice. I don't wear strapless very often, so that's why I got this. Okay, that one. Oh, I only got it in 2X. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Um, I don't know why. <laughs> Sometimes it recommends what size. Maybe it recommended me to get 2X. I don't know. 
Uh, this is the Plus Floral Sheared Button Front Pelton Bando. And that was $11.86 after a discount, $13.96 for. How cute is this top? Like, I've, I don't wear strapless tops ever, but like, it's so cute. And this is one of the ones I got in a 2X, which is an 18. And it fits perfectly. <laughs> Okay, this one will do, especially I think for the price. I think it was like 11 bucks. 11 bucks. <laughs> I will definitely be wearing bras with it though because <sighs> without proper undergarments, I look like I'm smuggling bread. Next, I don't. <sighs> it's a cute top. I'm gonna put it over my head again because I'm an idiot. It's got ruching at the back so it's stretchy. Like there's a stretch panel over here. Um, it's got these ties. So I think it's, I'm not sure how it's supposed to, I'm gonna have a look at the picture in a second to see how it's supposed to look. It's quite short for me. I like, oh, look at the fabric, isn't that cute? Cute fabric. Incidentally, I thought I ordered something that looked very similar to the dress I wore in my plushie video, you know, with that um, pink fabric with the flowers. Apparently I didn't, it's not here, so apparently I've got to do another show in Shein Hall at some stage to acquire that item. Okay, that one is a plain plus sheared back, not front. Okay, plus sheared back, not front, floral print, cami, $12.71. And I got that in a 2XL as well. I don't know why. Let's see if it fits. <laughs> okay, I feel like this one sits in a weird place on me. It's slightly too high uh, here. Um, and also, I don't know what you, how you, what you <laughs> do with these. Uh, do you tie like this? Do you tie it tight? Do you tie it loose? Do you tie it under I don't know. Let me look at the picture. In the picture, it literally just shows that she's tied the knot in, in the middle, but I don't know if you do it too tight. It looks weird. <laughs> this, this, this is a, this is a question shirt. <laughs> uh, I think you just tie a knot like that. See, but now this fits inside out-ish. Okay, how's that? This one is a little bit short in the back for me. I'm not a huge fan of the length of it. And also this looks friggin' weird. Uh, I think this one's a miss for me because I still don't, like, I don't know what's going on here. Uh. <laughs> I need to take this off the hangout. This is the only thing I could hang this on without falling off. It is a crotch top thing like low V crop thing with upset sleeves. <laughs> there are the upset sleeves. And yeah, it's like a real crop thing, so I don't know how that's gonna work or whether it's gonna look nice. <laughs> There's not even a label in this one. <laughs> Who made it? I don't know. It feels like that extremely stretchy material. I find it odd that the sleeves are like stitched in this way, but yeah, whatever. I'm sure it was like 10 bucks, so okay. So sleeve and surprise, surprise. Okay, crop top, and it was $16.11. So it's more expensive than the other two. For that. Don't know why. And I got that in 3XL. Again, don't know why I got it in a bigger size than the other ones. I know what this is. I know what this is. I know what this is. It's a green. I think it's a mini dress, I think it's supposed to be a mini dress, I don't know if it's going to be a mini dress on me. It's got ruched sides here and a really wide, <laughs> I've had to MacGyver it onto the hanger so it will stay because <laughs> it's a really wide uh, neckline like this, uh, you know, really open. And it looks so good on model. 
also comes in like four colors. I got green, but I was tempted by red, but I already had a bunch of red stuff in my bag, so I didn't get red. This is the solid surplus. There's that word again. What is a sur surplus? Surplus neck belted dress, and that was $16.11. Uh, and it comes to just above her knee, so I don't know what it's gonna come to on me. Yeah, this is cute. <laughs> I hate the fact that it's a mini skirt and the legs are out. <laughs> I hate my legs. Um, but I love how cute this is. It's just so cute. Um, I like the fact it's got this fake ruching here, so it looks like, you know, that's where the thing goes. Um, and I like the colour. It just looks really cute. I need some of those like uh, little short things, you know. <laughs> those short, you know, the shorts. The, I need short. I need shorts to get under this shit. <laughs> Amazing looking high low top thing. <laughs> it's got these cool buttons on it. And yeah, it's like really short the front, you, like the girl in the picture was wearing it over jeans so I will probably wear it over my pants and it has a zip which is interesting anyway I got this in a 3XL it feels very polyester -y, like stretchy but it feels very crepey like polyester -y. thankfully it's quite thick which is what you want from a black top that looks like a coat but you know okay as soon as I put this on <laughs> I had to get my husband to do it up because the zip is really long um <laughs> I said I'm late for marching band <laughs> can you do my zip up it's a little bit goth for me like I'm, I'm not this goth um I just feel like it makes my chest look massive and it's slightly tight on the arms but other than that I think it's actually pretty cute. <laughs> I think I need a better bra. All that I'm coming up with today is I need better bras and underwear. Uh, all the time that I'm doing this it's, uh, it's becoming obvious that things do not fit <laughs> and they're really like my boobs love it. <sighs> they should be here right? So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm in two minds basically because now my nipples have massive, or my boobs have massive nipples. So that's that's a thing. Answers on a postcard. What do you guys you think? It's cute. Oh. <laughs> you think it's cute, or am I literally going? Am I late for marching? Am I late for marching? I'm late for marching. Uh, let's start with this one, which I have tried on already. <laughs> it was part of my I'm scared, so I'm trying it thing on Saturday and it's a cold shoulder top but it's got these straps that sit on your shoulder and it's got like a little fluttery sleeve and it's this really nice red and I've got it oh, I don't, and like you know it stops you know where you expect a t-shirt to stop on the front it's a high low so on the front it looks like a normal t-shirt with a cold shoulder on the back. It goes all the way down <laughs> into this, hey I'm come to play your piano <laughs> tail. It looks like the back of a like a tux, you know, tails and tux. But I really like this uh, little lace design that goes all the way down the back. I walked this to the supermarket on certain. Really easy, comfy to wear. Made of jersey, love it. And I really like the colour. Oh yeah, I really like this one. But again, <laughs> whose recital am I going to? <laughs> Have a piano bitch to flip it out. Um, yeah, I really like the back. The back's really cute, apart from the fact that you know, you can see the theme. It's just a really easy wear. Like I wore this to the supermarket on Saturday and I felt cool 
plate. I wasn't hot for the first time in a long time going to the supermarket. Mostly because I keep wearing fucking hoodies to the supermarket. That's that's me problem. <laughs> Not everyone else problem. <laughs> anyway, this is really cute and I like how far down the little sleevey things come. <coughs> and I like the colour. I don't know if this one comes in other colours, but I would be happy to purchase it in other colours if it does. <sighs> okay, this is giving me PTSD to my last video. Uh, it's a sheared off the shoulder bandeau style top with flouncy sleeves. If you remember the travesty of the last haul, one of these almost made me cry <laughs> because it was simultaneously the worst fabric I've ever put on and one of the thickest and see-through at the same time. Whereas this one feels actually really nice. It feels kind of light, not too... Can you stop that? Kind of light, not too light and it's got these cute sleeves and it's got... Um, it feels like it's slightly layered. Yeah, there's a, there's a slippy thing inside. Is that which is good and the ruching is much or shearing ruching shearing ruching shearing shearing ruching okay shearing is much larger so it should at least accommodate some of my boobs which is the last one i think i got this in yeah 3x <laughs> was twenty dollars thirty seven the red t-shirt fourteen dollars forty one and this white sheared, sheared, sheared shirt is called a Bardo sheared layered flounce sleeve dress, which I will call it on. I don't think it's long enough for me to wear as a dress, but we'll give it a go, maybe. <sighs> okay, this fits, but it's see-through. You can see my bra straight through. <laughs> I think it looks really cute, but yeah, I a white bra, I guess. Nude, nude bra, nude bra. Um, because there's no way I can call it. It's just not gonna happen. Yet. Um, at least it's country miles ahead of the one that I tried on last week. Let's put it that way. <laughs> it's um. It's on a different planet, <laughs> pretty much. Uh, the only thing is, this keeps riding up like this. Like I, I'm not sure where it's supposed to sit, but it keeps sort of sliding up because it's all one big bit of elastic. <laughs> so I'm not 100% sold. See the fun. I'll be back. I'm just gonna go milk a cow. It's twenty dollars thirty seven. Did I say how much the t-shirt was? Through it, there is a couple more items left. <laughs> it makes me laugh. Okay, first of all, it's another jumpsuit. Why? Why did I do this? And it's in that ponty fabric that the kind of, you know, the, the not, not what's, what's the word I'm for? It's not. Uh, it's not pleated. It's ponty. But it looks like you know really narrow pleating and it's one of those like low top effort things you know the splice thing that they keep talking about on the instructions <laughs> and when i took this out of the bag it's from their special motif range which means slightly more expensive a card fell out i'll get it hold on this this focus on you yeah there we go this is what fell out of this package and it says motif silk collection 100% silk this is not silk it's 100% polyester <laughs> but they tried but there was an attempt i'm sure there is a shirt in the range that is 100% silk somewhere i just didn't buy it the sleeves sit on a weird place for me other than that i like it <laughs> Very strange feeling to have a crotch that's like really far down. It's very strange. I'm not sold on how breathable the fabric also. I feel like on camera it's slightly see-through. 
even though it's not slightly see-through in person. Like if you look in the mirror, I can't see my bar, but I can see it in the viewfinder. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Okay, so this is the top. This is my first time ever buying a set of something. Okay. Guys, I bought a mini skirt. I don't know why. <laughs> I have a feeling it's going to be very see-through as well. It's like that cheat the... Yeah, I mean it's got exposed seams on purpose, which is cute. A matching sneezing bit. Um, no, it comes with a matching little crop top, I guess. I'm forgetting to tell you the prices of shit as I'm going along, or the names of shit as I'm going along. The motif jumpsuit, where is it? Oh, you hear something? It was thirty-three dollars and five cents. Holy moly, thirty-three dollars! And I did get it in a three XL just in case because you know, one torso. And the the little set, which is probably you know, horrendous on me. <laughs> Sixteen dollars ninety-six. I just realised that I did not show you. It's got. Well, it shows in the picture that it's got little little flared sleeves. See that? It's actually just got a slight slit in it that makes it. Google ladies looking up flared sleeves. It's actually just got a little cut in it which makes it look slightly just flared. <laughs> this skirt is the single worst thing I've put on today. It's like. The sausage one, the sausage factory called it once its fucking skins back. Oh my god, this is so bad. The top is really cute. I might keep the top of this guy. Just... Look at it. Look. <laughs> oh no. This next one is a bodycon dress in this very interesting fabric. And I got this in a 2X because I hate my life. And it was only $15.26. It's a plus plunging neck colour block print dress. As you can see, there is a theme throughout my haul, which is, look, boobs. <laughs> I have a feeling this is going to sheer out on me a little bit because you can see light through the fabric where it's blue. So I have a feeling it's like it's gonna stretch and it's gonna be like, hey, look, <laughs> this fabric's actually white underneath. You know that unattractive? It's cute. I hope it looks nice, but I don't I, Yeah. I think I need to stop buying the things that are called body con. <laughs> um, <laughs> I just, I don't think I have the body for body con. <laughs> I don't know what's happening here. Like, my boobs are really not really fine. Um, I really like the top half, apart from the, yeah. Um, but either I need to get like smoothing and shaking underwear. Which, I don't know if you put shape, smoothing and shaking underwear on out of but it's very constricting. I like how it does this, like it kind of tries to, it, it tries, but this is, it's the 2X and it's big on top, like it's really quite big on top. So, there's that. <laughs> Other than that, I'm like, oh my goodness. But I think it's more because that's the way my body is shaped with my heels. I mean, tell me, does it look fucking terrible? This last, last this top is a little thinner, which I've just put on back to front. It's a little fun halter neck. I don't even know if it's going to cover my boobs. It's got a bit of shearing though, so hopefully it'll do a thing. It'll do a thing, it'll do a thing. Um, it's, it's a tie up one, so it's adjustable to some extent, I guess. And I enjoyed the fabric, I thought the fabric was really cute on this. I don't know if it's going to suit me though, because uh, pretty much everything. Oh god, why did I only buy a 2x? <laughs> I only 
put it in today's. Okay, that is a plants sheared backless halter top and it was $11.01. Okay, this looks nice from here. <laughs> but other than that, it, it, there's, there's like a weird gapage here, so it doesn't like mold to the actual shape of your boob, or it does, and I'm too wide in the boot. I'm not sure, like, it doesn't work for me this top at all. Um, it's a shame because it looks really cute, but it just doesn't work on my body shape. I don't think it's my boobs are too ginormous. The goodies are just too good. I don't know. It's, yeah. It's not pretty, is it? <laughs> um, yeah, from the side and from the back, it's just a car crash. <laughs> so this one's a no. Oh, we have another she a sheared effort with tie, tie straps instead of things. So wholly adjustable. And it's got this little tiered effect here. Um, this sheared just trying to attack them on my home. Um, the sheared part looks a lot smaller than on the other one. I may have needed the 3X in this. But we'll see, we'll see. I really like the colour. Really nice colour and I like the hey, do your own ties. Unless you go to you know middle school, in which case <sighs> items like this and that water neck. Boys are evil, evil creatures. One of them will undo it. Trust me. <laughs> that one is a not shoulder layered hem sheared cami top. And that was $16.96. Okay, this is just okay. Um, you can all the fact that the ties are in different places. I redid this one because it's too long. Um, it's just okay because it's just kind of a bit... You know, I feel like I'm wearing those baby doll underwear things that they have on lingerie websites. You know, those... It's not my favourite. I don't know, there's just something about it where I'm like, eh, you know, it's just eh. Right. Okay, while I was hanging this back up, I tied all the, stri the shoulder straps together. Hear me out. <laughs> It looks way better like this. <laughs> On the last item, and this is something that Sheehan tried to get me to buy a hundred times, a thousand times. And it is a midi length strapless dress with a pleated bottom. Plus a notch neck pleated tube dress in a 3XL. I definitely got 3XL in this one. And it was 29.72. Yeah, Shein has been advertising this dress to me and advertising this dress to me. It's like, please, this dress, we made it for you. So there's the top bit. It's got the rubbery stuff and it's also got metal, something there to hold it in place. And it's got a zip, which is nice. And pleated. Isn't that nice? Nice, nice, nice. Let's stop using the word nice, Alison. Anyway, ooh, ooh, there is some static in there. This is the one that Sheehan has been trying to get me to buy for, I want to say five months. <laughs> hey, I bought it now, you stop advertising it to me. This stress did this to my face. To say I'm informed about this is an understatement. Like, it doesn't fit here, it took me, 20 minutes to actually do the zip up because A the zip sucks and B apparently the top is too small for me even though I bought three. Um the skirt bit is awesome. Uh, the back is a mess, the front is a mess. This is cute. <laughs> and that is all. Okay, so you seen all of the shit show that is some of the clothes and you know, the winners and losers. There was a few winners and a few very much losers. Now, um, my favorites, this white shirt, 
the strapless what a ba bardo bando top the mini the green mini dress thing <laughs> the red t-shirt I think there was one more item that I really really liked that I can't remember <laughs> because I had to sit down for like an hour after I filmed because my foot is absolutely killing me yesterday um, you know how I broke my foot my kid then on it crushed my foot so today has not been great yeah so there were some super misses like the hilarious twin set that I got oh no <laughs> and the dress that Shein has been trying to make me buy for like a year that I finally bought and the zip got stuck uh, it did not fit properly and then I couldn't get it off again <laughs> Um, I was so hot and sweaty by the time I'd got it on and then off again, I literally had to take my makeup off. <laughs> so that was sad, even though I bought it. I bought it in a 3XL, so I bought it in the larger size um, and it still just didn't work for me. Main takeaway from this video is I need new underwear. <laughs> I need a new bra. I, I need new bra. I all of those now. Also, I'm going to get some like smoothie shapewear things to see if we can make body con look a little bit better on me because I know some people have the confidence to wear these things with their lumps and bumps showing and yay for them. I'm just not there. Like it, the same with the crop top, with the cute little black crop top wheel shop, which I will wear over something fine, but I'm just not there. I'm just not confident enough in myself to wear that out in public <laughs> let me know which was your favorite piece and uh, what your favorite pieces from Shein are because this is literally the first time i'm trying it and obviously it's very hit and miss the main takeaway from what other than the underwear thing that i have is that jumpsuits do actually there are some jumpsuits that fit don't buy them from Fashion Nova. And there we go. So both the jumpsuits in this haul fit absolutely. In fact, I think the motif one, which said 100% silk and 100% polyester, um, was actually a little bit too big. I'm thinking about I'm thinking about testing the return policy machine by sending some of this stuff back. Uh, I'll look it up and see how difficult it is because. I'm definitely sending the dress back and I'm definitely probably sending that one jumpsuit back just because it was too freaking big and the twin set thing <laughs> I like the top half but I just won't wear it like there's, there's no there's no point in me keeping it I won't get wear it so I'm just gonna send that as well the, the white sh sheared bandeau dress thing um I didn't like the fact that it was see-through and it sit kind of weird on me, so I'll probably send that one back as well. And the halter neck, which really... So there's about what, half this haul that I liked and half of it that wasn't appropriate or suited me, so... I'm gonna test the old uh, returns method and see how we go. Um, but I did enjoy this and I do have another Shein order already on its way to me. <laughs> Um, but that one's a little bit more Halloween-y themed and also I finalised it when I was drunk so there could be a few surprises. <laughs> anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, if you've enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button and ring the freaking bell to switch some notifications. That's the way. Don't forget to ring the bell to uh, put notifications on for the next time I post a silly video which will be Wednesday and I can't remember what you, like I was going to do the second half of this on Wednesday but I think instead we've got uh, several things we can do like the ASOS haul that just showed up on Sunday for post service uh, or I've got a couple of things like <laughs> uh, so at the supermarket on Saturday I may have purchased a eyebrow dyeing kit <laughs> we can do that let's see what happens on Wednesday <laughs>